Hi, Noah. Mark, good after well, good afternoon now. It's not morning. <laughs> How are you? I'm fantastic. How are you? Doing great, Mark. It is so great to be here with you this afternoon. It's been a busy, busy day for me already, but I mean, I had to make time for you because I think you're awesome and I'm oh. loving this show, Temptation Island. Thank it's you for making time, Noah. I appreciate yes, that. Yes, yes. So let's go ahead and talk about it, Mark. So USA series Temptation Island is a massive hit and is being talked about all over the country, reaching an average, listen to you, this, you guys, 2.4 million people each week that the show airs. Uh, Mark, this is a show that the people are literally going crazy for. So joining as the host, how does this make you feel knowing that it's doing so swell? You know, uh, in my position, I show up to work and do the best that I can and hope for the best knowing I have no control. That yeah. people are watching it and enjoying it and along for the ride is just, uh, I'm just grateful. That's all I can say. Yeah. Well, the show focuses on like, you know, four couples at a crossroads in their relationships who travel together to Maui, Hawaii to live with 24 singles and determine mm -hmm. if they are you know, really truly with the right person. Juicy. So being in the second season, what's really made this season bigger than the first, if that's even possible? Well, you know, uh, what I love about the show is that the format stays uh -huh. the same. It, we don't have to really mix up the format at all. Yeah. And it is as different as the couples who come to the island. So last season had a vibe and it went the way it went. This season has been insane and has everything to do with the four couples that showed up and the singles. So mm -hmm. that ride has been unexpected. It has been crazy. And, um, and now we're down to the end to see if they're going to stay together or not. Mm, that's going to be interesting to watch and see and find out. Of course, we'll have to watch each and every uh, Thursday uh, to, to see what's really going to go down and happen on this, uh, on this lovely island, Temptation <laughs> Island. <laughs> it is a lovely island. Yes. Yeah. yes. So what does a normal day consist of for you, Mark, uh, for, when, you know, for when you're on set getting ready to tape? You know, walk us through an ordinary day of how it's like for you hosting this show because it, it is so interesting to see it all play out on USA. Well, Pretty much when you see me on camera with uh -huh. the couples is the time I spend with the couples. Really? Uh -huh. Yeah, I try to stay out of it. As soon as I show up yeah. in the villa, everybody starts to panic. Yeah. So <laughs> I'll show up oh, and no. say, hey, today's a date day. You need to select dates or on a vote off, you know, if they're going to get rid of somebody, I'll show up yeah. for that. But really the bulk of my work and the brunt, the longer days are the bonfires. And I'll show up about 530 or 6, sit with the producer, talk about, where are the couples and what do we expect, where, where, what's been going on with them. Mm -hmm. I don't look at the clips. I, I, I see the clips when they see the clips. Wow. I don't pick the clips. I have nothing to do with that. Uh -huh. And then what you see the bonfire is cut down, but, you know, that's about an hour. Each one of those bonfires is about an hour, hour and a half. Mm -hmm. And I'm really, you, as you'll notice, I have no notes. They're, we're just kind of mm -hmm. just doing this and mm -hmm. um, seeing where it goes. And um, so my days are pretty open. I spend my time with my wife and we go to the yeah. beach and we, you know, watch the sunset and, and oh, I love uh, it. you know, and then I show up to work and, and that's my family too. The crew is amazing. Uh -huh. And, and truthfully, these couples are never far from my thoughts. Uh -huh. I, I, I'm pretty invested in it and it's, it's, it's pretty real for me. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it. And two, speaking about, you know, uh, you and your wife, y'all have been married for 31 years. That 32. 32. Oh, 32. Got to update that oh. every year unless oh, you... Oh, excuse me now. Me. 32. Yeah. Uh-huh. Let uh -huh. me... Uh-huh. Uh-huh. 32. <laughs> well, speaking about love and dating, all that fun stuff, how did you and your wife meet? Okay. Come on. Tell us, Mark. Walk us all down right. memory lane. <laughs> all right. Well, let's just let it out. I, um, <laughs> many years ago, when I was... 22, I guess, 21, I was singing and dancing waiter at a restaurant in uh, oh. Orange County down at, at, uh, down at the beach. And okay, no. my wife's uncle came to the restaurant for, to see the show and had been there before and demanded that my wife came down to see the show and she had no interest in driving down from Hollywood. Uh -huh. And um, she was cute and, uh, and I wanted to date her. And uh, I met her there. We exchanged phone numbers, and then I lost her number. Oh, no. It was, I put oh, it in my apron because I was a waiter, and I lost it. And, yeah, and oh, then no. she called me a few days later and says, you know, my uncle said never call boys, but she said, <laughs> he said to me, you call this one. And I, was, I said, I'm so glad you called, and we went out, and we've been together pretty much ever since. Oh, 
Where's my tissue? Oh. I know. Oh. I know. Oh. Oh, Mark. Oh, I love it. Oh, I, I love this show. It's all about spreading love, and we need love in the world today. And this show, it, it, well, you know, you never know what's going to happen when you watch. You now, know? Noah, before you Jesus. go, I detect an accent. Now, where are you from? Oh, uh, I'm from the South, you know, from Georgia, like Anna Camp, you know. Per, I'm from uh, South Carolina, Miami. born in Savannah. That's why I asked. Really? Yeah. Uh, because I See, knew look, you were my area. I could tell from the accent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, y'all, you know, we, uh, uh, good food down here, southern food. Mm -hmm. I can't go there if I'm going to be on TV because yeah. be, <laughs> I, I go off the wagon when I go back home. <laughs> you know, people have been wanting me to cook with Paula Dean. I'm like, okay, uh-huh. You All know, right. I throw down. I can make my own greens, my own fried chicken. And, you know, I got a big garden. I'm southern. I got my own uh -huh. chickens in the backyard, so. You know, if that, uh, th oh, that sounds real good. Yeah, we have a garden every summer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's great. Yeah, you know, we live out here in the south. And I always tell people we live in the boonies because we have tons of acres of land. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Deer running through the yard. Oh, God. You know what? <laughs> I'm like, just another day here in the south. You know? I know. <laughs> I know. Well, you're, we're practically cousins. No, I get it. <laughs> I'm like, well, I'm going to have to make the move uh, next year. Next year, I won't be seeing that deer running out through L.A. Uh-uh. You know, well, I'll tell like you what. We'll swap. I'll take your farmhouse, and you come okay. live out here in Hollywood. Okay, all right. <laughs> we'll swap it out. Okay, all right. Oh, yes, yes, yes. All right. All okay, right. now. All right. <laughs> okay, Mark. Thank this you. This has Mark. been so much fun. Thank you, Mark, for joining me. Temptation Island Thursdays on the USA Network. You take care and have a good holiday season. You know, we can say happy holidays. It's December now. Now, yeah, absolutely. We certainly yeah. can. Happy holidays to you, too. Have a good one. Bye All now. Right. Bye-bye. <laughs>